It is a women's bantamweight matchup between Amanda Nunes and Chris Cyborg. Ready to fight. All right, so round one is underway. Going to be very interesting to see how this fight plays out between one fighter who does everything well against kind of a striking specialist on the other side. And the problem with being a striking specialist is that you have to be upright. When you're facing a full-on mixed martial artist, expect a level change. We are going to see what type of improvement she's made in terms of defending herself in those wrestling situations. Dig and kick. Oh, and there's another leg kick just out, right? I mean, now she has sort of rendered her opponent, as you see the damage, uh, a one-legged fight. She is fighting a one-legged fighter, a wounded gazelle right in front of a right. hungry lion. That is not a great position. Powerful leg kick lands. Great vision, great defensive instincts by her there as she continues to block the majority of these shots coming her way. Her hands are always where they're supposed to be. Can't take me though. She has to react. She has to go chase the finish. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Under three minutes now to go on the round. Oh! Oh! Goes down again! Oh, big left! Massive head kick! Just getting snapped back like a turtle. Beautiful call. Oh, that hurt. She is such a diverse striker that that big strike landed, and it looks like she's going to finish this fight. Oh, huge head kick. What a strike by her there. I'd be knocked out. Her opponent still stands. She's still standing, but she's got to get on the right side. She's got to get out to the center of the outside. Crack her face so that she can evade her opponent from finishing her. Gets up again here, but hurting. Big head kick. So 100 minutes to go here in what has been a competitive and action-packed first round. Oh! Oh, straight right! Cyborg gets touched by that kick there. And just misses with that big right hand. Is she standing? Brutal knee to the body. Oh! Oh, oh! Oh, straight right. How about those five minutes? All right, an interesting 60 seconds now between rounds as the round comes to an end. And of course, we're talking about that cut on her cheek. If that thing gets any worse, you got to think they're going to stop the fight. Location is fine, but the blood flow is not. All right, she is all <laughs> Nunez's shot is blocked. So she lands the double jab now, DC. And again, she has said a lot about not just being a one-trick pony, not just being one and done, but to continue to throw volume. And she is certainly doing that too. Much. She's doing a fantastic job fighting behind the jab. And look at her double it up. It's a thing of beauty. Good series of strikes by her there. She is staying wicked busy to Very busy, but also super accurate. She is on point. Oh! Beautiful 
body kick lands right under the elbow. Oh, you can never know what you're gonna see with this young lady. Is she gonna finish the fight? Oh, straight right. Such a fast leg pass, leg pass. Well, she's had a lot of moments in the fight. You know, her one is very good, but you're not even getting one, two. What about the one, two? What about the one, two, three? How about an uppercut following the three strikes? Allow them to string together. Be confident in knowing that you have practiced this. You are ready to land in combination. Let it go. She can't take pictures now. She has to react. She has to go chase the finish. All right, so a nice job there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. She has certainly picked up the pace here in round two and starting to find herself in the pocket a little bit. She was a little bit hesitant in round one. No hesitancy whatsoever here in round two. She has clearly found her rhythm and range. Nice punch from the top. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. 20 seconds left. Get the turn in that kick. Trying to double up on that jab. Cyborg's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Ten minutes in the books. Caution, flammable. That horn signifies. You ready to fight? Ready. Third round underway. Oh, big punch land. Oh, beautiful combination. Very efficient with her strikes tonight. Well, she's... Whoa! She is such a diverse striker that that big strike landed, and it looks like she's going to... ...DC, and now her opponent may be seeing stars at this point. Her opponent's seeing stars. Her opponent's hurt. She has to really get after her now and try to find that kill shot that's going to finish the night. You can never know what you're gonna see with this young lady. Is she gonna finish the fight? Oh! Oh my goodness! Oh, big left hook there! Can you believe she is able to keep up this output just as she did in the previous round? Landing a high volume of strikes here and not whatsoever. She looks like she could go 10 hard fives if needs be so. Can't take pictures now. She has to react. She has to go chase the finish. Oh, another one. Knee to the body. Oh, beautiful kick by her there. She just. Oh. She is stuck. Oh, another one. Well, she's up, but she looks hurt. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. And she caught the kick. Left hand punch from the clinch. Nice job by her there to block those shots when you first go to a boxing class. Oh! You can never know what you're gonna see with this young lady. Is she gonna finish the fight? job by her there to reverse the position on her. She was in trouble, now she is... Oh! She can't take pictures now. She has to react. She has to go chase the finish.
she moves right into half guard. Without much effort, she was able to pass from her full guard right into half guard. When you get in a bad spot on the ground and you want to reverse it, that's what you need to do. A master class in changing position, unreal to see. 15 seconds. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over. Well, that is exactly the aggression and execution you are looking for from these fighters, especially late in the fight. Clearly, she told us during fight week she had to keep the judges out of it, and that really dovetailed with her approach late in the fight. She landed that seminal blow, and the ready for the official decision Bruce Buffer has. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest at 4 minutes, 49 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout. Christian Cyborg Justino! Well, there she is. This arena belongs to her here tonight.